CBC Radio 2, Canada's Music Network. Hi, I'm Angeline Tedeweo. Remember MySpace? Ten years ago, it was on the rise and getting bigger. Now it's kind of crawling along. But back then, it's how this next artist, Claire McGuire, got noticed. One of her songs racked up over a million plays. Here she is with Don't Mess Me Round on CBC Radio 2. This band is called the Harpoonist and the Axe Murderer, and they say it's a name that does not lend itself to border crossing or kids' festivals. That song was Don't Make Him Like They Used To on CBC Radio 2. I'm Angeline Tedeweo. Henry Ford said this, Anyone who stops learning is old, whether at 20 or 80. Anyone who keeps learning stays young. You're about to hear an artist who took those words to heart. Roxanne Potvin took a hiatus from music after a tour that cost more money than it brought in. She went back to school, recording school to learn more tools of her trade. Two benefits. Use it as a way to make some extra cash. Plus, she wouldn't have to outsource production anymore, as she could do it herself. So see if you can hear Roxanne's newfound knowledge on this song, The March, on CBC Radio 2. He is just so good. Michael Kuanuka, One More Night, CBC Radio 2 Morning. My name is Angeline Tedeweo. They were like a star that burned super hot and died fast. A dizzying love affair that crashed hard. A musical partnership that will be missed. I'm talking about the Civil Wars. It's hard to understand how two people can make such great music together but fail to get along. In their own words, they said it was... Internal discord and irreconcilable differences of ambition. So despite the awards, the cosign from Taylor Swift and being the darlings of the media, the civil wars will only live on in the music they made the three years they were together. Here is Barton Hollow on CBC Radio 2. Oh, they make you feel like you're watching them live when you hear that tune. Music from the Great Lakes Swimmers. I must have someone else's blues. If you've ever tried to drown those blues in booze and then thought it was a good idea to go digging through your contact list for someone to call, there are now ways to prevent that from happening. I'll tell you about it in moments on CBC Radio 2 Morning. <laughs> 